back to my channel today I just wanted to hop on and do a quick little um, weekend vlog today is Sunday and we're just hanging out at home and getting some stuff done I'm getting some Christmas stuff done and I'm just gonna bring you all along with me so come on to my mom's to drop off some homemade chicken soup that I made today. Uh, my mom hasn't been feeling good again uh, a while back. She was sick and she was in the hospital for a little while and um, now she has the same thing again and it's not COVID related or anything like that um, but it's something that's contagious and really hard to get rid of. So I'm taking her some chicken soup and hopefully that will be comforting. Um, but yeah, and this is also gonna count as a few minutes alone in the car without my children, <laughs> which is rare. So I'm gonna enjoy that. Okay, it's that time again to get out my pre-lit Jasper cashmere tree from Michaels. So I'm going to unbox it and put it up in front of my window and of course you can see my children have been here so I need to clean this room up too but I have everything ready for the tree to go right there and you can see I moved some stuff around normally the couch is in front of the window and then I put this over here so let's make sure that these lights still work that I have misplaced the stand. So I'm gonna go look for that, and then I'm gonna continue putting up the tree. Okay, I vaguely remembered that I had set it in my storage room outside the box. So that was easy. There's the tree, let's get this, let's get this thing up. work because I actually had someone um, comment on one of my older videos telling me that their lights didn't work and I think that they had only had it for a year maybe so I'm glad mine still work so you can see I'm gonna have some work to fluff this and some of the branches are messed up on the bottom from my cats uh, from last year so that'll be some fun try to straighten out. I tried to put the worst looking part in the back um, and go from there. But yeah, so the lights work and that is really nice. Um, this is the third year I've had this tree and it's still holding up so I'm really happy about that. I did want to show you all some fun stuff that Nate picked up today when he went to Meijer. He got this cute advent calendar uh, with a book for each day. And I think it was $22.45, so I don't know if that's a super good price or not, but I think it's really cute. And it's got something that literally both my kids love. Blue's Clues, Pop Troll, uh, Blaze. So there's a bunch in here that I think they'll like. Then Nate grabbed these, which we were actually thinking these were something a little bit different than they were. We thought it was a garland, but it's like these double-sided light strands, and please ignore the crumbs on my stove. But we're gonna put these outside. He got really excited about doing Christmas 
outdoor decorations all of a sudden and bought a bunch of stuff. Some clips to clip them up with. I think this was a power cord. And then he got these for me to put on my tree in the living room because some of my lights have already died. So here's my living room tree and the top is looking kind of wonky and I need to fix it. Um, the star made it like lean over and I don't know why. And it's really hard to see the lights because it's super bright in here today. But um, I still love this tree even though the pre-lit lights don't work on it. And it's <laughs> a huge pain to get all the lights on. But I love how tall it is. And once I get it good and fluffed out, I really like it. So I've spent like all day trying to get stuff done. I started with a grocery order at Walmart and I messed something up so it switched my store that I was gonna get my delivery from. And then when it switched stores, it wouldn't let me switch back. And half the stuff I had put in my cart um, was not in stock at the store that it would only let me order delivery from. So I had to go back and figure out what I could replace those things with. And I had strategically picked some of them because of Ibotta, so I was upset about that. That is a very first world problem, um, but I was upset about it. So I was trying to fix it, and I had Nate pick up some things that I couldn't get at our Walmart because they were out of stock. Um, so I got that done. Then it was lunchtime, then it was nap time, then I needed to take a shower. So I feel like I haven't gotten any stuff, like any of the stuff done that I intended to do other than making chicken noodle soup and taking that to my mom, which I really wanted to do. And it was nice to see her for a minute. And she seemed like she was feeling a lot better. So that made me happy and it was just nice to talk to her for a minute. And yeah, so now it is almost, it's 4.30. So I feel like I have some time to try to just get some laundry folded and put away and some toys cleaned up and then maybe clean a few bathrooms just get some things that need to be done done and start over i feel like last week got away from me and i didn't do a lot of the things that i try to stay on top of during the week with my clean mama routine which if you haven't heard of that it's super helpful you do um, like one cleaning thing a day that just takes a few minutes and then you kind of stay caught up throughout the week without getting slammed on the weekend which is what always happens to me um, but I haven't been doing that very well and so it seems like I turn around and on the weekend everything's dirty and I need to just clean everything but I'm gonna try to get a head start on this week today get a few things done that are super important like cleaning the bathrooms and then go into the week and do the clean mom routine so let's see if I can do it so I'm making breakfast for dinner we're having waffles with sprinkles in them and I'm making omelets so I've got some of that going and then there are hash browns in here This is what we ended up with for dinner, omelets and waffles and tater tots. There's Cohen, super excited. Here's this. Oh. And I made quite a mess over here on the stove. <laughs> you made a mess? On the stove I did, yeah. Hey, Cohen, you want to come outside and see the lights? I haven't seen them yet. The house I got to work on, the angle. Okay. You want to come see? That's really pretty. Shows up really pretty on the video. Those are so neat. It's kind of cold. It's 
Let's go back inside. The wind has been so crazy today. Gotta get rid of these pumpkins. You go. Thank you. That was so nice of you to hold the door. All right, sir. It's ready for you to go. The it's time for you to go to bed. Yeah. You really want to go downstairs? Yeah, I think you can go with your daddy. I'm getting ready. Take a bath later. Play basketball. Yeah. Yeah. The mom went out for his Okay. Let's go to bed. Say night night, everyone. <laughs> Come on, you want to go up the stairs? I'll let you go up the stairs. Well, wrong way. Come back. <laughs> you don't want to go to bed, huh? I can't see him. Where's Cohen? Oh, <gasps> there he is. All right, we gotta go to bed. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna, yeah, have to catch him. <laughs> Are you ready for bed? <laughs> Are you ready for bed? <laughs> What's your puppy's name? favorites this is femininity by steeped tea and you can see all the ingredients here it's just a really delicious it's almost Christmassy um, to me and I'm gonna make it and show you all how I do it Okay, it's been about five minutes, so that is about all the time I need. And this handy little uh, tea in infuser is wonderful because you can just pull it out and then it sits right on its lid and keeps all of the condensation and everything from getting everywhere. So that's nice. And there you have it. And then I'm just going to put a little bit of honey in it. And I think that'll be perfect. Well, I just fluffed it. And it's not perfect, but I'm kind of just wanting to go sit down and relax. So I've got it. I have all of these branches like propped up on each other because we have cats and they destroyed the bottom of this last year or Olive did and I'm sure this one's gonna help this year so it is what it is 
Um, I just hate like all these open spots. Ma'am, I need you to not. I need you to not ruin my tree. So it's nice having the tree up here in the front room and I only have, I think, one more tree to put up and then I just need to decorate them um, or finish decorating like the one in the living room and get everything out of the totes that I've just had sitting in my living room for a week and then I'll be done, I think. And now Nate is going to decorate the outside of the house, um, aside from the projector that he got, or the two projectors he got. So I'm anxious to see how that looks because we've never decorated outside before and I've always wanted to. We really didn't do it when I was little either and it's just kind of like a dream come true now that we're living in this house and I don't know. I'm excited like a little kid about Christmas decorations, so. I am going to go hang out with Nate and land it in the basement and relax because it has been a long day and I may end up doing some vlogging tomorrow. If not, then this will just go up and there won't be anything else, but I think I'm going to vlog tomorrow because I didn't film a lot today and it'll be nice to kind of transition from Sunday into Monday with Nate being on shift and just kind of going through our day. Um, probably won't do it during the actual day, but maybe in the evening and the morning since we're so busy during the day, but I am super out of breath. <laughs> I don't know why. So yeah, maybe I'll see you tomorrow. Maybe I won't. Maybe this will just go up and you can look for another video from me, um, later during the week, but yeah, I'll see you soon. This is a This is a